Hi, I'm Liam. Hi, I'm Tony. Hi, I'm Sandy. And we're from the Australia China Youth Association. We've been able to bring a delegation of scholars from all over the country, from Shanghai, Guangzhou, oh. Beijing, and beyond, um, to this one city, Chengdu, uh, to spend a few days together, getting to know each other, and participating in what has been the biggest Foundation for Australian Studies in China conference uh, today. None of that would have been possible without the generous support of the Australian Embassy in Beijing, the support of the Consulate General here in Chengdu, uh, the Westpac Foundation, the New Colombo Plan, um, and of course the support of the team that we have here from the Australia China Youth Association. I'm really, really lucky to be invited by Akya um, and be supported by the Australian Embassy in Beijing, as well as the Department of Foreign Affairs to attend the Classic Conference. So I'm here in Chengdu at the FASIC conference. Uh, it's my first time at FASIC and it's just been such a great experience to meet Australians who are really interested in China, Chinese scholars who are really interested in Australia. It's so exciting seeing the pace of change in the Australia-China space and what institutions like ACIA, like the Embassy and the New Colombo Plan have really been able to do with just leveraging networks to be so much more robust than they were just a few years ago. great experience um, to meet a lot, of new, a lot of new people and to kind of gauge how Australia and China are interacting with each other. Definitely I think there is more opportunity because the West China region is developing. Developing means there's more needs for talent. Australian students who come here, they're getting the, the best experience, the best out of their time. Um, and particularly in regards to Southwest China, because it is such a, a fast developing region um, in the country. Uh, it really is going to be the next phase in terms of Australia's, you know, trade, economic, cultural ties with China. To be able to work with Akya to promote this part of, of China to, you know, Australian students is really, really important. And I hope we can do more of it in the future. The annual FASIC conference has brought scholars from both Australia and China into China to, to talk about topics that cover almost every issue you can think of. The conference is also a really excellent example of how Akia, Consulate, the Embassy and FASIC come together and really build on the relationships that get created in, in these conferences.